Welcome back to the vlog. It has been a couple days since I have last picked up the camera because last you guys saw was that we were getting a snowstorm and we were losing power and we ended up going to stay with my parents. That's pretty much the last time I picked up the camera. I did show clips of our house being worked on so for example we had lost power the night before when we were sleeping so we woke up to no power and didn't have it all day long and it came in the late afternoon and by the time it came it was on and off since then so it was getting so cold to the point where we already burned the wood we had that's how we made the food that we had and warmed up the water but that was it after that we couldn't really do much and we weren't in a position or anyone's in a position to be like driving so yeah we packed up the baby the animals and like majority of our belongings and went to stay with my parents house we didn't know if we would be there like a night or two nights we ended up being there eight or nine days i think but in the process of us being there our power eventually came back on but then we didn't have any water so we couldn't come back and then the day after that um the pipe under my sink in the bathroom busted and was probably on for hours because we came we weren't staying here so every day after we heard our power came back on we came to check on the house to see if it was like we can come back in and whatever so that's when we came in actually we came the next day at night and um we just walked in into a pile of water and it was just gushing all we all we heard is just gushing water we just looked at each other and we were like okay we need to fix this shit but at that point it probably had been pouring for hours and we just never knew me and my husband spent the night we did not spend the night at the house but we spent the night cleaning all the water so we had bought this actually this expensive mop from Lowe's and my husband mopped majority of the water that was in our bathroom and our closet because they connect so it was flooded in there yes everything in my closet got flooded and it came all the way out I'll show you the videos but it came all the way out and stopped right at the living room so he spent the night doing that we were m moving our entire bedroom out because our whole carpet was just soaked every step you took was a squish because there was so much water and we our box spring got ruined um the second i saw it i was like oh shit that's done for it so now we don't have one <laughs> but it's fine because actually all three of us are kind of enjoying the mattress on the floor we took our frame away because of her so it's kind of our fault the bed was on the floor but now it's kind of better <laughs> But yeah, after that, we got carpet, um, and then they came and did new tile in our bathroom and closet. It looks so good. It looks exactly the way it did before. So it, all it does is look like we just moved in because it's just so nice and new and not messed up from cats. So yeah, we have been home for a while now. Uh, it took me an entire five days, the first week, to get the house back in order. But while I was doing that, I was washing everything. Literally, I washed. I had to wash all my clothes because they're in the low rack in the closet, so they all got wet. My wedding dress got wet. Um, a bunch of stuff. I had to throw away a dog bed. Um, I was just doing load after load of load. But while I was doing that, I was deep cleaning and um, donating and reorganizing and moving the house around. So it did take me all week, so I just kind of didn't film. But I did kind of film me doing her little toy area so i'll show you the update of what's different in the house i'll show you the room later um but because my husband's getting ready right now but i'll show you the drastic change that i end up doing because we're already in the process of literally if there was furniture all over the house it, it it was a wreck so this is the dining room and as you guys know our freezer was right there and then our dining table was right here so I turned it into her toy area. So this whole area is for her and she has been loving it. And because I was only using the dining table for my crafts, we end up turning this 
spare bedroom. It was really just a storage for a long time. Um, and to our office. So me and my husband split this. This is my desk with my stuff. That's an extra TV we have for her to keep her distracted. Sorry, the light's not on in here. And then this is the dining table. This is literally all my crafts. Like one of those bins is just my reefs because I used to have a reef business. And then all my current stuff, which I have a lot of stuff I'm working on, which I will talk about in another video. I'm not yet ready to like go into detail about it, but I've just been making a couple things, selling a couple things on Facebook. Nothing crazy, but it is actually so fun with the amount of crap that you can make with the Cricut. But I'm going to get back into my reefs very, very soon. I like miss doing it and I have all the supplies. I just don't know why I'm not doing it. <laughs> but anyways, that brings me on to today where we are going to go to the zoo. It is kind of gotten a little warmer here but it's still like breezy so we wanted to take advantage we're going with our sister-in-law again we went with her last time she babysits a boy so i'm gonna have to not vlog him i don't think it'll be that hard but she loves hanging out with her niece so we're all gonna go we're gonna cram in my tiny um hatchback and go to the Fort Worth Zoo. That's my favorite one. I don't think the Dallas one is very good at all. The Fort Worth one is like completely covered. So even if it was a hot and sunny day, we wouldn't get like beaded down on, even though I I burn regardless. So yeah, my husband's getting ready right now. Um, I think I'm gonna change her into pants because it is actually still a little chilly. It's really windy, but it is supposed to get in the 70s in the afternoon, which we'll get to the zoo by 12, so I don't know. She's ready for a nap. It's her nap time, but I'm kind of hoping she'll just sleep in the car because it's an hour, probably an hour and like 20 minute drive. She just put a toy in there. <laughs> What's in there? <laughs> What's that? Is that blue? Can you say blue? Can you say green? She does know some of her colors, but she's very sleepy. I don't know why she's doing this though. My sister does this to her. Why? You scratch me while you're doing it. Where'd it go? Where'd he go? She said, done. Wow! Yeah, 
supposed to touch him. You have no more, he might lick your fingers. You give him a kiss? He's very cute little baby. I have no more. Oh, ah, he licked me. <laughs> Girl. You're an ostrich. You're an ostrich? <laughs> Look what society is. Look. Why? <laughs> She's mad. <laughs> oh? Oh. 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 We're taking a quick lunch break right now. Ruben's, oh, what? <laughs> Ruben's are ordering us food right now. What's wrong? <laughs> Why are you comfy? What? You're a butt. Yes, you are. Yes. Right here, baby. <laughs> Where is it? Yeah. yeah. Kangaroo. Look, that one's sleeping. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> Yes, I adore you all of the time. I like to. Okay, so Ruben's weighing himself to compare his weight towards an animal. What does it say? I'm weighing 0.2 pounds compared to uh, an 800 pound cow. I'm weighing 2.9 pounds compared to 60 pound cow. Uh oh. Oh my god. Why you like the bridge? Oh. 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 Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> it's awesome. Look at all the people behind us. Oh my god. If I may. She sings this song. It's a door. You love it? Aww. I like to love you night and day, if I may, may, may. 